Welcome back friends. This is Solomon Jagwe. I'm back with another quick insight. And uh, this is not a tutorial per se. That's you know, just something that I wanted to point out that I'm working with. And so on the left hand side here, you can see the meta human being driven by this data that's coming from the perception neuron suit. And then on the right hand side, that information, that data is being sent to uh, Iclon using uh, Motion Live. So the on the left hand side of this the character that has the facial animation that's the one that is uh giving the meta human the facial animation and so on the right hand side is the dummy template of the meta human body and that is something that comes from the meta human creator character creator online so this character i use the meta human character creator online version the early access and uh this in the middle of course this perception neuron axis suit and the uh, software that i'm using is the access studio <laughs> and you can see how clean the data is i mean the foot contact the fingers and then you see how clean it goes through over to iclone and then you see the uh frame rate that i'm getting at about 35 between 35 and 36 uh, frames per second so the reason i'm pointing this out is that uh, so i for those of you who like do live uh, productions uh, this is just an idea of what you, you could be able to get if you wanted to use iClone as a, a production uh, system and then the perception neuron system partnered with iClone to drive a meta human character on the left hand side now later on i'm going to do a tutorial an in-depth tutorial on how i was able to hook the character here to be able to drive the meta human over on this side i've already done the facial animation part of it and so you can find it in one of my videos. I'll try to do. A, I'll try to put the link of that, the link of that tutorial in the description of this video. But what's exciting is being able to animate the meta human using iClone. And so it's really cool that in here the fingers, as you can see, I can actually uh, refine those. But right now because it's live, I, I'm not able to do that when it's uh, when Motion Live is running. But uh, if I wanted to fix the fingers, I could go in and record the data and then be able to fine tune that with the motion editor. But overall, I'm just uh, wanting to show the quality of the data and to see how the meta humans are coming alive using iClone, facial animation, the body animation, and this is the perception neuron in the center that is driving everything. So, I mean, you could put a uh, the actor como cap data on this model to drive both of them uh, because right now these both models are being driven by motion live right on this side you can see that so uh, again this is just a quick insight just to show you how i work or it with the systems that the workflow that i'm using to animate my meta humans again now uh, as always guys uh, do please spare a minute if you're new to my channel uh, thank you so much for dropping by uh, for all those who have I uh, already subscribed. I thank you so much. If you haven't subscribed yet, do please spare a minute to click that not, uh, subscription button and then notification bell so you're alerted when I post a new video. And as always, thank you so much to the patrons that make this content possible. You guys, your support that you're giving me every single month makes it possible for other artists out there who are unable to so, to you know afford the support so that, that we help each other. So if you're able, consider becoming a patron. But overall, it's exciting to be able to do this as a indie filmmakers. But overall, the data is clean. This is live. This is streaming live. As you can see, the link is activated over here, the Unreal Live link. And this is actually free to if you have an account with a iClone, an iClone account uh, with Reillusion. Sorry, if you have a Reillusion account and you own iClone, this plugin is free for you to be able to send this data, sorry, <clears throat> this data to the Unreal Engine using uh, the Unreal Live link. But, and then of course you have to activate the live link over here to be able to do that. So thank you guys again for joining me today. I appreciate your support. Please, please, whatever you do, stay safe. Dare to dream big, never ever give up on your dream guys. And thankfully these systems are becoming available to make, help us to tell our stories. Uh, thank you so much for your support guys and stay safe, dare to dream big as always. Thank you so much. Bye for now.